Hey there, welcome to Car Clinic. Today we're talking about why your car's RPM goes up and down at idle, almost like it's revving on its own. If you haven't already, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell so you don't miss valuable videos like this one. Let's dive in. Reason 1. A dirty throttle body. Over time, carbon deposits and grime can accumulate on the throttle plate, restricting airflow. The throttle body is responsible for regulating how much air enters the engine, so when it's dirty, the engine struggles to get enough air at idle. The result? The RPM starts bouncing up and down as the engine computer tries to compensate. The good news is that this issue can often be fixed with a throttle body cleaning. Using a throttle body cleaner spray and a clean cloth, you can remove the built-up grime and restore smooth airflow, helping your engine idle consistently. Reason 2. A faulty idle air control valve. This small but important component works with the throttle body to regulate your engine's idle speed. It controls how much air bypasses the throttle plate when you're not pressing the gas pedal. If the idle air control valve gets clogged with carbon or starts to fail, the engine can't regulate idle properly. This often leads to the RPM climbing up and down, especially when you're stopped. If cleaning the valve doesn't work, you may need to replace it. A malfunctioning IAC valve is a common issue in older vehicles, so it's definitely worth checking. Reason 3. Vacuum Leaks Your engine depends on a precise mix of air and fuel to run smoothly. If there's a leak somewhere in the vacuum system, like a cracked hose, a loose fitting, or a worn-out gasket, extra air can enter the engine. This unmetered air disrupts the air-to-fuel ratio, forcing the engine to rev up and down as it struggles to adjust. You might even hear a hissing sound under the hood, which is a telltale sign of a vacuum leak. Fixing this issue could be as simple as replacing a damaged hose or sealing a gasket. Reason 4. A Dirty Mass Airflow Sensor The MAF sensor measures how much air is entering the engine and tells the car's computer how much fuel to inject. When it's dirty or malfunctioning, it sends incorrect readings, which throws off the air-to-fuel mix. At idle, this imbalance can cause the engine to rev erratically as it struggles to maintain smooth operation. Cleaning the mass airflow sensor with a dedicated MAF sensor cleaner can often solve the problem. If that doesn't work, the sensor may need to be replaced. Reason 5. Worn out spark plugs or ignition coils. If your spark plugs are worn or fouled, or if an ignition coil is failing, the engine can misfire. These misfires are especially noticeable at idle because the engine isn't working very hard, so any inconsistency becomes obvious. When the spark doesn't fire properly, the engine stumbles and the RPM starts jumping around. Replacing old spark plugs or faulty ignition coils can help restore consistent combustion and smooth out the idle. This is a common issue, especially if your car has high mileage. Reason 6. Clogged Fuel Injectors Fuel injectors are responsible for spraying fuel into the engine at precise intervals. Over time, they can become clogged with carbon deposits or dirt, leading to uneven fuel delivery. At idle, this causes the engine to struggle, which shows up as fluctuating RPMs. A professional fuel system cleaning can often fix clogged injectors, or in severe cases, they may need to be replaced. Keeping up with fuel system maintenance helps prevent this issue in the long run. Reason 7. A stuck or faulty EGR valve. The exhaust gas recirculation valve, or EGR valve, helps reduce emissions by sending a small amount of exhaust gas back into the engine. If the EGR valve gets stuck open or clogged, it can disrupt the engine's air-fuel balance. This disruption is especially noticeable at idle, where the engine is running at low power, and any imbalance can cause it to rev up and down. Cleaning the EGR valve or replacing it can usually solve the issue. Reason 8. Malfunctioning Engine Sensors Your engine relies on several sensors to run efficiently, including the oxygen sensor, coolant temperature sensor, and MAP sensor. If one of these sensors starts to fail, it can send incorrect data to the engine control unit. For example, a bad oxygen sensor might tell the computer that the engine is running too lean or too rich, leading to RPM instability at idle. Scanning the engine for error codes can help identify which sensor is causing the problem. Reason 9. Low transmission fluid. When the transmission is low on fluid, it struggles to operate, which puts extra load on the engine.
This can cause the RPM to fluctuate as the engine tries to compensate. Checking the transmission fluid level and topping it up can often resolve this problem. If the fluid looks dark or burnt, it's a sign you may need a full transmission service. If you found this video helpful, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, and leave a comment below with any questions you have.